Hello, this video is going to show you how to export grades from Canvas Gradebook and import them into your Focus Gradebook. So I have um, started here in Canvas just from my home screen. You can click on grades over on the left hand side and this brings you to the Canvas Gradebook. Up at the top you have a few different options. So I'm going to click on Actions and then you're going to click export. It will show you the previous time when you exported, so I've already exported mine, so I don't need to actually do it again. Um, when you click export though, it is going to take a few seconds. It tells you that it started, um, but it may take a few seconds before it actually shows up. Um, if you're using Chrome, it'll show up in your downloads here at the bottom, so you can click on that and open it. So I'm going to open mine that I already had downloaded a minute ago. So when you open it, there's a bunch of different information. The kids' names are over on the side. I just have them hidden right now. Um, the only really important information you need is the column that's SIS user ID. So that's their actual student ID. Um, and then whatever grade that you actually want. So on this one, I want the Introduction to Honors Chemistry assignment. So what I'm going to do just to make it easier when I download in Focus or upload into Focus, excuse me, I'm going to delete everything in between those two columns. So I'm just going to highlight and then right click or two finger click and delete those columns. So now the SIS user ID and the assignment grade that I actually want are side by side. And that just makes it easier when you go to focus. So uh, you do need to save that after you delete those columns and just say yes. This is a .csv or comma separated value file um, so you do need to keep that formatting. So then when I go to um, Focus. I have already created my assignment. You do have to do your add assignment and have the assignment already here. And then just click on the little I that's part of the assignment heading. So when you do that, you have all of your same assignment options as when you originally created it. Plus you have a new option over here on the right hand side to import CSV file. So click on that and it opens a new little box and you're going to select your file. Mine is sitting in my downloads here. And I'm going to select points. Um, that's how mine is set up in Canvas. If you have percent, you would need to switch that. And um, by the way, School City does use percent. So if you're uploading a, a CSV from School City, you would need percent. So now you just have to tell it where in your spreadsheet are your um, ID and your grades. So column three or column C um, as the way that it's listed over here. Um, so C or the third column over is your SIS student ID. And then my grade is in the column next to it. So the score column is column four. And that's why I deleted everything in between just to make it easier to, so I don't have to count how many columns over it is. And then just click upload. And it takes a few seconds and then you can see that all of the grades have been dropped in here. Um, now I have a couple of classes cross-listed so when I import for one as long as you downloaded the gradebook for all of the classes and not just one section and um, when you import to focus if that assignment is linked to all of your classes it will download when you download all of it together from Canvas, it will upload all of it together in Focus. So when I go to my seventh period that's cross-listed with my sixth period, I can see those grades are there as well. And that's it. 